Well, people aren't the only ones having a tough time with what seems like a prolonged winter this year. Local beekeepers report many are losing hives. Yeah, and with an already dwindling bee population today, one group set out to help replenish the local supply. Turn on your side, Stephanie Harris went to a parking lot in Portsmouth buzzing with activity. It certainly was. All right, guys, so honeybees are actually responsible for about $15 billion worth of crop pollination every year, but a lot of them have been dying off in recent years from unknown diseases. Now, this harsh winter has also hit them. Today, a local beekeeper brought in new supplies to help the local population. Bees by the thousands, bringing new hope after a stinging winter. It's been a fairly major die off. Local beekeepers, even experienced ones, report losing all of their bees. It's pretty humbling when you open a hive that was robust and thriving two weeks ago and you look in and they're all gone. Not even dead bees, just gone. And we don't know where they go. So this man, Richard Taylor, called Boone, North Carolina and had 250 of these nucleus beehives delivered to Portsmouth. What we're doing is we're really augmenting the local supply of bees. State inspected and healthy sit 250 of these bee colonies in a box, each its own small hive. So all we have to do is make them bigger. And that's easy because we got plenty of flowers. Dave Pugh drove all the way from Shenandoah to pick up 27 hives for himself and others. You can't have too many bees. The rest of the hives will stay in Hampton Roads. Keepers pay about 150 bucks a box. They say it's not cheap, but it's an investment in the environment. Every strawberry you eat has been visited. That strawberry flower was visited by a pollinator at least seven times. Every single strawberry. It's also a lot of work, sometimes dangerous work. But it's a, a labor of love. And the fruits of that labor are worth a few little stings. I haven't gotten any honey exactly yet. Because they know it'll pay off. Now, Taylor tells me that he will be getting another shipment of bees in about two weeks. So if you are interested, contact the Norfolk Beekeepers Association. We put the information on wavy.com. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side.